Um, I'll keep that between me and the players. I think there's certain things you uh, to keep in the locker room. Um, and, uh, you know, it was an emotional rock locker room. It's a quiet locker room. No one, no one spoke for, you know, you know, for whatever three hours before, you know, we tipped off. No one really spoke, and, and uh, sometimes there, there are no words, and I didn't have any words uh, uh, to console them. I know uh, it's important that we were were together, um, you know, um, but emotional, emotional night for all of us. What is his, what is his legacy? mean to you man you know you know it, it, it just uh um it's iconic you know then what else can you say like iconic and and uh um all of us i think here like the the uh uh you know it's like the memories of him uh uh you know are they're, they're ingrained you know there's iconic is the best best word i can use understanding that some of the games were going on earlier than other ones. I mean, did you think there was a chance that they they might not play these games at all? I mean, I'd rather keep my opinion on that to myself. Okay. What I thought about that, oh, what I think about that. Have you talked to Kyrie? Yeah, I was with him. I was with him. You know, I'll keep that private, but uh, they were very close. Tough, 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 tough times. And you were... Uh... You were in the building, I think, when he set the record here, uh, weren't you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Incredible, incredible f performance, and and uh, you know, I, that's like yeah, that's iconic, right? And and, uh, and I, I thought about all our guys that have played again, you know, especially GT and and uh, DeAndre, those guys. Uh, you know, Spencer had a had a good relationship with Kobe, so you know, uh, it it it, it uh, kind of reverberates is at the curve throughout the league you know throughout the fabric of the league and uh, uh again tough tough uh tough night at the class by the knicks fans you know uh chanting his name and and uh but uh you know um very difficult night were you guys already here when you found out or were you yes we we're here is it tough to prepare for a game under those circumstances i don't know it's just surreal like you just you, you, you just like I said it was just complete silence it wasn't a word spoken and you know a tragedy like that there there, there are no words but I I'm glad we were together you know and that was that was uh, uh, we we're present and, and you know um, but no, no one no one spoke. What do you think about Kobe? Would it be fair to say that we all know how competitive he was, but he was also a great teammate, and that's a hard thing to kind of bond, but he did it well. Yeah, I, you know, I wish I'd had the chance to be around him, you know, coach him, or that, that would have been, or, or, or be on the team he was on. I, I just, yeah, the competitor, uh, uh, I think how he pushed other guys, too, to be to be great. I think he, he, uh, uh, he had that... that you know, you shouldn't have say Paqua, you know, or that's that's the only thing. He, he had something special, and and uh, uh, you know, my last moment, like he he was at the Barclay Center, and and uh, I didn't even think he knew my name, you know, and he came up, you know, hey coach, you know, gave me a hug. I didn't even know, you know, that's like, you know, I think we're all, wow, you know, he even knows my name, <laughs> it's, you know, and those are those are. Uh, uh, I ran right home after the game and and told my wife like, you know, Kobe. You know, gave me the little little hug there, so that's pretty cool. Well, Kenny, with the reference to the game at Barclays, December 21st of last year, and there he was in attendance with his daughter.